A Bella Vista High School homecoming float at the center of an investigation tonight. Some are calling it racist. CBS 13's Madison Keevy joins us live with why some are upset and the details on a now active investigation. Madison, what are we learning? Well, we'll start with what the homecoming theme was. Cops and robbers changed the day before for concerns that it wasn't appropriate. Change from cops and robbers to an Adam Sandler dress up day. So then the question, how did a float end up in the homecoming parade that led to some calling it racist? This photo was posted on Instagram last month by a community member concerned by the Fair Oaks High School's homecoming float. We blurred students' faces because they're minors. A young black man is pictured behind bars on the float in an orange jumpsuit. And it appears that the students in the photo dressed as officers are white. It's why some students and community members called the float and theme racist. The investigation found that the school staff approved the float, even though the cops and robbers theme was changed because students had already put in several weeks of work and it was done. That's all according to a spokesperson for the San Juan Unified School District. Ultimately, the district spokesperson said the investigation found that that was the wrong decision. And now, as a result of the concerns, there are plans to, quote, expand efforts with our black student union and several community partners to build opportunities and support for our black students to engage, share their voices and build community. In answering our questions tonight, a district spokesperson at this predominantly white high school said staff here will engage in professional learning. That's a direct quote moving forward because of this incident. We also learned that all high schools in the San Juan Unified School District will now have to undergo a series of questions before they pick themes for things like homecoming week.